Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Sport here, and today I'm taking out the MI24 Hind by Eagle Dynamics. I haven't flown this module very much, and I'm very unfamiliar, so I wanted to take some time to get reacquainted with it and see some of the improvements that they've made to both the flight model and to the uh, Petrovich AI CPG. Okay, so easing back up on the collective here for a uh, somewhat steady liftoff. And let's go ahead and get a little bit of forward momentum. So in this mission, we're playing as a UN peacekeeper. As you can see in the opening sequence, a uh, World Food Program convoy got attacked by some insurgents. We're part of a quick reaction force, which is going to go and check things out. The Hind has been out for a little over eight months now. And in a world filled with precision guided munitions and laser targeting, it's kind of nice to step into something that's a little bit more analog. In this particular case, I love the fact that the map display is just a set of moving cursors. And as you can see, our flight path takes us uh, out, out of Lebanon and into Syria, and rounding the corner so that we avoid Israeli airspace for political reasons. Alright, looks like we're going to clear this ridge no problem, and as we do, we're going to uh, start turning to the south and look for the area in which that uh, convoy got ambushed. Well, the smoke out in the distance might be a pretty good indicator that that's where we need to head. I see the convoy down there. It looks like the escorts and two of the trucks were destroyed. Everything else looks intact. Seems like there's a group of guys and some trucks standing by. And Oh, shit! Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and say that those guys are decidedly not friendly. Uh, we're going to swing around here and set up for a missile attack on that AA gun. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and target the general area of where those guys were, and looks like Petrovich has immediately picked up that AA gun and uh, is going to move his sight to indicate where it is. All right, looks like we have a good track there. There's the tone and fire. All right, it looks like good effects on that technical. Let's go ahead and bring it around and set up for a unguided rocket pass. The uh, other helicopters in the QRF should be approaching soon. Running on up. Let's uh, go ahead and make sure we keep it clear of the convoy. Good effects on target. Going to reposition for a final gun run.
is on the deck and securing the location. We'll go ahead and uh, turn back for home. Okay, well that was a pretty successful engagement. We used uh, pretty much three of the Heinz primary weapon systems in order to uh, eliminate the threats as well as secure the LZ for the QRF force to land and uh, secure any survivors and recover any bodies there at the uh, scene. Alright, set up here for the landing pad. I'm going to go ahead and slip it a little bit to give me a little bit of better visibility since I'm uh, landing on a pretty tight square. And all at the same time, uh, just cross-referencing my rate of descent and forward velocity so I don't settle into any VRS. Alright, not bad. The helicopter's in one piece. Definitely better than some of my previous attempts. If you've made it this far in the video, I want to thank you for sticking around. I do my best to put out high quality content and hope to earn at least a like or a comment, or at most, your subscription to the channel. I hope you've enjoyed this DCS MI24 Hind video, and I'll see you next time.